A Million Ways to Die in the West, Short Mood View. Seth MacFarlane stars as a cowardly sheep farmer who loses his girlfriend, Amanda Seyfried, because of his unwillingness to duel. And he really, he's really depressed by this loss. And when he meets Anna, played by Charlie's Throne, he gets some more courage and she trains him for a duel. But then her husband, Clinch Leatherwood, played by Liam Neeson, the biggest badass of the frontier shows up and he wants to duel with Seth and yes this is a mm, kind of comedy it's nowhere near as, as 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 good of a comedy as Ted and it, some, some say that it's like one out of four jokes in this work. I'd say it's more like two-thirds, but there definitely are a number of them that should have been cut or improved upon, and, and certainly the film is over long at 110 minutes. The, the romantic portions of this aren't that compelling. You don't care enough about the the love life of these people and it doesn't help that the whole romantic comedy story structure feels like it's been lifted from romantic comedy from 20 years ago. It goes through every beat that you expect it to. You have the pathetic, you know, midnight drunken, yeah, meeting where he makes a fool of himself trying to get her back. You have him confronting the, the new guy who's a douche and who is only the new guy with, with the girl because he's so successful. Yeah, it's, it's really surprisingly conventional on aspects like this. The film is easily at its best when it makes jokes about the time and setting of the, the film, how sucky it is to live during the Wild West. And other than these stretches where there really aren't any jokes, such as when it's trying to be dramatic or sentimental or scary, yeah, it's, it's a pretty fun film, although if you aren't really big Seth MacFarlane fan, you'll probably want to skip it. If you like this review and one more detailed one, the link will be in the description box. Please rate and comment, and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.